All right, sorry guys, my video was cut off for space and I was not even aware that I was short on it. So I'm gonna pick right back up to where I was. Obviously, I didn't defeat Negan, but as you can see, he went from red to yellow. I am literally going to attach this to the end of this other video that was cut off and just call it a day. I wanna get this up, this event. We don't even know. There's not even like a really a clock that is on it. All right, so anyway, so... Your clock start, starts over every 24 minutes or 24 hours. You obviously have plenty of time to do tier five, but again, it isn't as easy as it seems. Now, with him now turning yellow, I can change up my entire team. We're on phase three out of five, lightning reflexes, AP down. And then, of course, you've got to remember he does all of these as well, all of these assistant skills. Okay, so all of those go against you. So what we're going to do is come in here. We're obviously going to edit the team out. Um, I'm going to take in green and a lot of it because he is green. All right. So let's go ahead and do our yellow. So let's go ahead and do this. All right. Let's see who's who. He neutralizes. And that's right. So we are going to do this for him. And then I wanted to say that I thought he did Guardian, but that's all right. It's fine. That'll do. All right, so let's go in there and see what kind of damage we can do here. All right, so this is what I was talking about. Here's the three different colors. Negan himself is yellow. So we're going to actually go after the tank itself. And the reason why is, again, there are other hawks in here right now, and they are attacking. I have green up. I might as well do my very best to take the yellow off the side of the tank. Someone else can get Negan, or someone else can get the other parts. I brought in an all green team. I need to go for yellow. Obviously, the tank parts have to come off, and they don't go towards killing Negan, but they still have to be killed off before you can kill Negan completely. And then once you, you know, do some of that, then you're good to go. Um, and as, okay, so this is where everyone's like, where does this come from? Do you see how I'm hitting these tank parts and they have an AR on them? Those are the assistant skills they're talking about. So I can literally click on this and you can see exactly what it does. Every eight turns, it deals 500% non-trait damage and negative 30% AP to a line of enemies. And that does the assistance skills of this. Then it also has attack, defense, and health of 6,000. Well, 5,937, but how much closer do you want to be? All right. So then, of course, the second one, you can do that as well. We've got this. Same thing. Health on this one, 130,480. Every six turns impairs up to three enemies for two turns and also does all the assistance. Then you have this one, special ability. Every seven turns grant 35% crit, attack, and defense for three turns to Negan and other components. 72,059 health. Holy bejesus. That is a lot. All right. So, I mean, that's just the tank parts. Now you've got Negan as well. Negan as well. Let's see if it will let me. All right. So he does AP down. His health is 278,005. Are you kidding right now? Good Lord. Um, a greater chance to cause negative 15 AP to the attacker. And then obviously he has the adrenaline rush Deal 400% damage and impair for one turn to align the enemies. All teammates get elusive for two turns and recover from all penalties. So his tank parts are fine. Then the assistant skills, the same thing. Absolutely absurd. Like, wow. All right. Now, as you can see, as I'm hitting Negan, now it's starting to take off those points at the top. Um, sorry, spammer. Um... And you just have to keep working at it. Again, you know, I'm going to time out, but I really did want to show you guys the tank parts. So I was grateful to be able to do at least that. So yeah, you guys just need to keep coming in here and keep trying over and over and over again. Um, 
I think that I just used my last turn, honestly, and never took my most powerful demon there, but that's fine. I really did just want to show you guys how this works and really how to beat it. Um, it's not an easy thing to do, especially when they have the events like this. It really isn't. All right, so do your best, you guys. Kick ass out there. I'm going to go ahead and post this up. If you have any questions, if you have any concerns, if you aren't sure exactly how this all works, um, you know, don't hesitate. That's what I'm here for. So, and please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. So many of my my viewers aren't subscribed to my channel. It helps me. It helps you guys. I promise you. And one of these days, I will have the time to go into the extreme detail of how all of that connects. But it is absolutely the most complicated crap I've ever seen in my life. But it does help everyone. So that's the goal. All right. So please, please, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Keep kicking ass out there, you guys. Um, I'm sorry that this event is so hard. I, I am just as bummed as everyone else. Um, I was really excited for it. And I know that everyone is really, really struggling and seeing we haven't seen it in a while, you know, it's a little discouraging. So don't get too discouraged, you know, don't forget. Um, and I've been wanting to do this. Welcome, Tex, Walker, Texas Ranger, our new CM. He is so awesome, you guys. He legitimately gives a shit. He really does. Give him a solid chance. Let the dude try. He's only been here for a couple of weeks. He knows nothing about our community. He's he's just learning. Give him a chance. He has some awesome ideas. He has some awesome things he wants to do for us. But you guys, if we keep cussing these people out and treating them like crap, they're not going to stay. Just like GR left, just like JB left. Now, I keep saying it, and I'm not going to stop saying it. Every time, every time, grow up challenge. Let's get it going. Everyone needs to grow up and treat everyone with basic human respect. Nothing more, nothing less. Be kind, compassionate, patient. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Again, the few things that we've learned since kindergarten, let's do those things. So again, welcome, Tex. I'm super excited to see what you bring um, and the changes you bring. So just the line of communication that is open now um, to the from the players to the developers per him is amazing. And I know this. So you guys really give them a shot here. Give them a chance. Give them six months. I know that seems like a long time, but think about walking into a new job in a community full of people like us. <laughs> Let's be serious. We are not an easy group. We know this game. We've been here a long time. We have so many demands. And we are the most passionate people you will ever see, ever. And, and that's all wonderful. It really is. Um, but, again, let's not run him off. Let's give him an honest chance to take care, to help us and to do this. So, all right, you guys, that's it. Um, welcome, Tax. Super excited, excited to have you here. I really am. I hope you guys are kicking ass out there. Anyone has any tips, any help, anything that, you know, I'm wrong on, I misquoted, whatever, you know, please, by all means, comment below, share it. Knowledge is power. Ten heads are better than one. I'm the first one to admit I know nothing except for what I think I know. And some of that isn't even, you know, 100%. I do not know all, even though I wish I did. All right, perfectly imperfect me, right? Have a great rest of the week, you guys. Yay, the weekend is almost here. And I have some very exciting news coming for you Monday. I'm not going to say anything else besides that. So don't forget, subscribe so that you can be notified of my news come Monday. Have a good one, guys. Hey, guys. So we've had an update in the game, and I know that there's been some videos on it already, et cetera, et cetera, and that's all awesome it is. Um, but I was just got done doing a video, and I decided I was going to go and um, as I was talking and go just play And uh, as I finished up. And I went in, and I went to go ahead, and so the roadmap has some new stuff going on right now as well. And I've heard a little bit of everything from this is, like, so hard, it's ridiculous, to um, 
impossible to no big deal. I haven't tried it myself yet. I have no idea. But I did notice a couple of things, and I wanted to point them out because as they do these updates, the one thing I think they forget to do is inform us of some of these really cool changes that they do. And if you don't pay attention and really pay attention to your screen, you miss out on so much information. It's insane. So, um, and so hey guys, so we just finished tier five, Negan. Um, I'm going to attach this right to the bottom of the video, so or the end of the video, so I know it will seem weird as it goes on. And now I'm talking again and starting a video for a third time. But I wanted to show you guys this. It's truly mind blowing. Congratulations, your faction has defeated the boss. So let's go on in there. Yay, Negan is dead. All right, first place, second place, third place. Total points earned, et cetera, et cetera. Rewards. This is the part I wanted you guys to see the most. Rank one, 5,040. And you get one out of each of these. So let's go through it real quick. So one set, a set contains one out of the four sets, right? So you get one out of each. So you'll either get two of the uh, silver paint, two, two of these, right? This is your first set. Your second, and you get two of these. Your third, and you get two of one of these. Just one, but you get two of each. And then on this one, you get just one of these. That's for first place. Can I show you that again? First place rewards. Second place rewards, very similar. A couple of differences, less options, less chances of getting good stuff. And then it continues on. And it's just the same. And continues. Hold on, I'm sorry. Does this change? Because from what I can see, two, two, two. Nope, it does not even change. The bag itself does not change. The only difference in the faction um, salt rewards for tier five is literally a couple hundred assault markers. That's it. Um, wow. I, uh, I am sincerely disappointed. I have seen, I've heard, Wow. All right, so that's tier five. So let's go in here and seeing that this is a tournament, my next question is, how often do we get to run this? Five days? Five days. How long is this going on for? Um, I'm sure it's not five days. I don't even think we've ever had an event that lasted five days. Not a tournament. And this seems to be a tournament. What I don't understand, though, is that it pops up on your screen when you come in. Tells you we have this tournament going on. There are no rewards in Tier 5 at all for this special guy. And I, a hunter, I think, is his name. There is nothing for him. No other special rewards whatsoever. And then a five-day clock. And as you can see, again, we weren't kidding. We were really saving for the faction total points. Um... <laughs> We have a million. Like, are you kidding? Um, tier 6, Negan. Let's see. And this I'm going to go through, and I'm going to show you guys the new changes. But the rewards are right here. And the rewards are 750 Falcon tokens, 2,000 Falcon tokens for rank 2 to 3, and 1 Falcon Leash for rank one and then of course the same bag you can get everywhere else plus the same amount of tokens um with these token um with these let me go in here and find this i have no i have not seen all right so falcon leashes you get one you get to pick one out of these right and then with those tokens, I want to, 
99, yes, here they are. So with the tokens, your chances are, are at a bunch of stuff. It's Kyle. Sorry, Kyle. Um, but here are your odds. The collection items are 0.3%. Ascendable Epic Recruits, 1%. Ultra Rare Trainer, which, come on. 2%. Rare Trainer, 3%. Uncommon Trainer, 4%. Epic Recruits, 20%. Ultra Rare Recruits, 69.8%. Does not even say that there is a chance for 6 stars on here at all. Just Ascendable Epic Recruits, and it's a 1% chance. So you can get an Ascendable 5 star. Um, my opinion on this, strictly mine and mine alone... These awards are the worst we've ever seen. And I am quite surprised and would like to know if somebody bumped their head or we have someone new um, that does not know how the game works. But, I mean, your odds of getting Burt are, you know, two-star trainer or, like, your best odds. Um, or a, a four-star. Like, honestly, a four-star character. I That's just, huh. All right. So that's that, you guys. That's what's going on with Faction Assault. I'm going to go ahead and attach this. I'm going to show you some of these new updates, some things that have changed. They're super cool, these new little... They're just doing some cool stuff, and it it is helpful if you know it's there. So my job is to show you where it's at. All right, so Hawk is now coordinating, and we're going to do Tier 6, and I'm going to show it to you guys. So wish us luck. All right, you guys, don't forget, like, subscribe, and share. Have a wonderful day, and uh, we'll be back with you in Tier 6 soon.